The capabilities that we have in the engineering and in our labs is absolutely amazing to have as an engineering team, but also to showcase for our customers. Our engineering team is always pushing the innovation envelope on what we can be doing around smarter, healthier, more automated buildings. And we're doing that by building control systems and advanced digital systems. I spent several years working in renewable energy and Johnson Control's commitment to sustainability is important to me in my career. We have at least 400 devices. How does that enable Open Blue? Well, this is really the model behind how the data gets up to Open Blue so we can then monitor what's happening with our customers' sites to maintain their sustainability, their carbon footprint, and of course, help them to save energy by controlling their HVAC equipment. All of our testing is going to be focused on, uh, at this time, on controls, uh, refrigeration, actuators, building controls, sensors. Uh, that's what our main focus will be, um, but in the future we plan to expand to other JCI product lines. It's almost going to be like a fresh new start for us and at the new facility. It's going to be all on one level. The proximity of it, the collaboration between technicians and engineers is going to be more cohesive. That flow is going to make us much more efficient and uh, just make uh, the whole work environment much nicer. We have a certified program here at JCI that will benefit all the JCI platforms uh, across the world and we will actually perform at a higher level uh, with the benefit of the new facility. When we move to the new facility, we will also be pursuing additional certifications that will allow us to keep all of our testing in-house. You know, we've been in this building since 1895 and we're very excited to be bringing elements of that history up to our new innovation center in Glendale. Uh, I feel this is going to be one of the best labs, not only in the state, but also in the world.